somewhere between a grin and a cry and a scream all at the same time and some kind of happiness. This is how I feel every time I ride my bike. Man, I just like riding anywhere, everywhere, all the time. Up, down, and around the mountain. This is lines on trails. Going as fast as I know how, having sketchy moments, and then just pulling it off and going way faster than I thought was possible. When I get to the bottom of the hill and I'm like, holy cow, I didn't know I could go that fast. That's when I feel the best. I had the mountains. I really got here and learned the area a lot better, so I had a better feel for the trails that were around. And then I got a gym membership, so it, everything just kind of fell together where the schedule, the time, the money, everything just worked where I was like, I need to devote my time to being good at something, so I decided I wanted to do mountain biking full time. Ideally, I wish that I could get on the perfect program, get all the fitness down right, have all the perfect trails to ride and the training and the time to devote to it so that I could go pro, get a pro license and, and see where that goes. That's going to take a lot of work and dedication to training and the technical skill that that involves is insane. So it would take at least two years for me to be able to think of doing that. Or three. First I got to get the pro license, then go a few years after that. Oh, there's a tree there. Oh my, watch oh. out, watch out, watch out! Oh. Found the tree. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, watch out. Oh dang. You like this? You like this? Oh yeah, look at it. I can't see it in the, the arm. Back. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, okay. It's easy to push through the pain when I'm training because I keep telling myself if I push hard enough, go fast enough, go long enough, then I'll eventually be better than everyone else in competition. I want to be the best in the world at everything. That's just my personality, so yeah. <laughs>